marrying the children of the living God. We thank God for a new day today. The Lord has made us to that make us to see yet another new day. Let us give glory unto the name of that Lord. Let us lift up the name of the Lord on high. Come into his presence with praise. Come into his presence with thanksgiving. Begin to appreciate him this morning. Oh, Father, we thank you. Lord Jesus, we magnify your name. Begin to thank him because you are the, the reapers of the joy of salvation. Appreciate God, the Lord that has kept us, the Lord that has sustained us, the Lord that has given us the gift of life and of salvation, the Lord that has made us a wonder in the eyes of our enemies. Because why they say for you are still standing? Why they say die, you are living? Why they say, oh, be thou cast out and be scattered? You are higher than them and standing stronger than them. Begin to appreciate that God. Begin to magnify the name of the Lord. The Lord that has shown us faithfulness in everywhere, in at all, at all our side. Begin to appreciate it. Father, we thank you. Lord Jesus, we magnify your name. We thank you, Father, for the gift of life. We thank you for this morning. We thank you, Lord, for that, Lord, because you have shown us your faithfulness. You have sustained us. You have uphold us. Oh, you have scattered the evil devices against us. We appreciate you. We say, be thou exalted. Father, be thou glorified. Oh, Lord, oh, Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Break forth into singing. Begin to speak in tongue. Rakama shantari kayeke. Hari amara kasentari kamayaka hari kama sente. Ya mahasente. Begin to sing praises unto the name of the Lord. Approach the throne of God today by praise. Come into his court with thanksgiving. Oh, hallelujah. For the Lord God, omnipotent reigneth. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah, for the Lord God, whom in the potent reign. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh, glory, glory, glory to the Lord. Oh, glory, glory, glory to the Lord. Hallelujah. Hosanna, 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 blessed be the name of the Lord, ha, ha, Hosanna, 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 blessed be the name of the Lord. Begin to plead the blood of Jesus Christ upon your spirit, upon your soul, that by no means shall you be condemned in the presence of God. Proceed unto the presence of the Lord today by the sprinkled blood of the Lamb. For he's our mediator, he that intercedes for us, he that stands before the Lord on our behalf. Begin to plead that blood of Jesus upon your spirit, upon your soul. Oh, Marashi Kentara Kama Sente, that in your prayer today you will receive in the presence of the Lord. Oh, ye came Shanta, we plead the blood of Jesus upon our spirit, upon our soul. Oh, Mayaka Sinta, upon every area of our life, even upon our conscience, from every dead work, we, we plead the blood of Jesus. Oh, Mayake Sente Reke, we come Shanta Rika. Holy Spirit, we thank you. Lord Jesus, we magnify your name before we proceed into prayer prayers and whatever we want to share in the word of God. Ask for the Holy Spirit. For many people have asked before the Lord because they did not ask, they ask amiss. They could not receive. We don't want to ask amiss because we are three or three Two or three people are gathered in the name of the Lord. He, he has promised that he is in our midst. Oh, to fulfill every of our petition, to fulfill every of our request in prayer. We come a kayeke, hari amara kasente. Begin to plead the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Oh, yes, in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, today, oh, Lord, fill us with your spirit. The Holy Spirit incubate us. Oh, with fire. In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes, let our prayer be, be fire. Let our prayer halter be fire that the devil will not rubbish our prayer today as we proceed into your presence. Oh, my yaka shantari kayaka hari hamara sente. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's take the reading Bible, the Bible for this morning section from the book of Ecclesiastes 3, 
1 to 4. To everything, there is a season, a time to a time to every purpose under the heaven, a time to be born, a time to die, a time to plant, a time to plug out up what is planted, a time to kill, a time to heal, a time to break down, a time to build, a time to weep, a time to laugh, a time to mourn, a time to dance, a time to cast away stones, a time to gather stones together, a time to embrace and time to refrain from embracing. We are going to seven. A time to get, a time to lose, a time to keep, a time to cast away, a time to rend, and a time to sow, a time to, to keep silent, a time to speak. As the children of God, and it is a, a time to love, it continues like that, a time to hate, a time for war, a time for peace, a time to have profit, a time to labor, a time to travel, a time to exercise that which we need to exercise before the law to get our right, and every and a, a time for every beautiful thing, that there is always a time. He has made, he has made everything beautiful in his time. As the children of God, I want to tell you that the time, there are times for occurrences of things on earth, which the heavens will, like, will have sanctioned, which the heavens has prepared for the sons of, the, of God. He has sanctioned it. He has, it has been written. We as the children of God, we must know there are times for, for things to occur in our life, when it, and in, in, in the, in the, on earth, because the mandate of God all the time, and what is it is written, it is written, everything about this world it is it has already been written whatever will happen it has already been written so because of that as the children of god we must be vigilant spiritually to take that which is good at the time when it is the season of good things and when it is the season of evil thing we should have the strength to 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 avert them from us by prayer it is by prayer we are able to draw from that which is written with the heavens has released unto the earth, which is of good, we draw it by prayer unto ourselves. And that which is written, which is of evil, we scatter it as the children of God and take it away from us and away from our path that we will not be victim, but we shall be victor. We come as shantari, kayeke, arima hasenta. So as the children of the living God today, I want you to lift up your voice because evils are the day the Lord has told us you must redeem the day. Oh my yeke, in your prayer, in the prayer, in before your Lord, you will, uh, you first have to set away. You must have set away before the presence of, in the presence of your God, before you set out because there are many evils. There are many devices. There are many agendas which are evil, which may not favor us because we have a good father who has made us to be sensitive, sens feel, spirit filled, to be sensitive. We know the season. So devil cannot cheat us. Just, devil cannot, cannot deprive us. It is good to be spiritually sensitive and your spiritual sensitiv sensitivity start from the from your altar, oh yes, from the from the devotion for having to have a fellowship and a communion with your God before setting out. Oh my shantari kayeki hari ha maraka. The Lord keep us in the name of Jesus. We will not fall victim at this time because the end time has come and many evils are happening. You must not leave your house without having forty to fortify yourself, without having to possess that which you need to possess before your father. Whatever you have taken and you have possessed in the presence of your father, no demon or power of darkness can take it from you or hence they will die rakama shanta rika yeke hayakama santa i want you to say oh lord i seek as the children of God, uh, let us quickly look at Jeremiah, the book of Jeremiah, Jeremiah 25. For, I've, for I have satisfied the weary soul, and I have replenished every sorrowful, sorrowful, sorrowful soul. As the children of God, the Lord has come. She, he came. He has satisfied our weary soul. Oh, and he has replenished every, every of our sorrowful soul. It is now a rejoicing in our own tabernacle. Even the world may be scattered. Even there may be up, up and down. Oh, but in my tabernacle and your tabernacle, it is rejoicing. As the children of God, let us go into prayers and begin to possess that which you need to possess. Every evil we need to avert away. 
Let us begin to take it away. Rakama Shanta. I want you to say, oh Lord, by the blood of Jesus, there is nothing you can do without the blood of Jesus. It is that which put you aside, that no evil can touch you. You need to immerse yourself into the blood of Jesus. Begin to sanctify yourself again in the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, as I'm going out today, I yes, I, 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 I sanctify myself with the blood of Jesus. I put the mark of the Lord Jesus Christ upon me. I say no evil shall come near me. No evil shall take control over 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 that my situation in the name of Jesus. Oh yes, in the name of Jesus. In my own situation, in my own land, in all that I do, the Lord shall take preeminence. He shall take control. He shall take control over my affairs. Oh yes, in the name of Jesus. The affairs of your life must not be taken control by the wicked ones. For they, they, they make the testy one to go more testy. They will not give unto you. Because of that, as the children of God, begin to pray. I take charge over today. Yaka Mashantarika. As I go, I plead the blood of Jesus Christ upon me. Yara Masente, blood of Jesus, speak for me today. Oh yes, in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I draw the strength. When you come into the presence of God, you draw strength. You draw the anointing. Oh, to break through. Anointing to, anointing to do that which, you, which is greater than the one you have done yesterday. That is what you have come to take in the presence of God. I want you to say, I draw strength, oh, from the throne of Christ Almighty God, oh, I draw strength unto victory, that when I go out, I shall possess my possession, that when I go out, oh, yes, everything I lay my hands to do shall be a blessing. I possess that strength, I possess that anointing to break new floor, to break new ground, in the name of Jesus, I possess that anointing to break new ground, oh, to move forward, oh, yes, in the name of Jesus, oh, yes, in the mighty name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. In the verse we have read in Ecclesiastes, maybe you can quickly use it to pray as the children of God because evils are the day. He said the time to die. Oh yes. Oh, I rebook every every death. Every pattern of death. Oh, every agenda of death. Over my life as I set out today. As I seek out, as I go out to, to seek for my daily bread. Oh, I say death will not be my portion. As I, as I go out, oh, to seek the daily bread today. Oh, death will not be my portion. Evil will not be my portion. I shall possess that which, which, which will nourish me. I shall possess that. Oh, which will, which will be a supply. Oh, for my needs in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, we thank you. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. I want you to, I want us to use the let's quickly take that Bible verse again. Ecclesiastes. We are going to use it to pray. A time to burn. Oh yes. A time to burn. Oh yes. Good thing. Begin to comfort in our life. Oh, I say right now, the good thing. Oh, the good good planting. New things that will nourish us. New things that will be, that will, that will spring forth. Oh, that will show us as a living testimony. Begin to spring forth in our life. Oh, yes, in the name of Jesus. Oh, as I set out today. Oh, let new thing. Oh, that will gladden my heart. New thing, oh Lord, Father, that will nourish me. Oh, new thing, Father, that will make me to be a living testimony. Oh, let it begin to spring forth. Let them be born into my life. Let them begin to spring for in the name of Jesus. Oh yes, in the name of Jesus. Oh this season is the season of evil. Evils are too much. You hear killing here. You hear killing there. Many things are happening. I want you to say, my soul be delivered. Oh, by the sanctified blood of the Lamb. As I will be going out and in. Oh, with me and my family. My soul be delivered by the sanctified blood of the Lamb. But the devil, devil is destroying the souls of people. He is harvesting them into hellfire pa, pa, pa. without without even when you know when you are not prepared oh in jesus name we pray i say by the blood of jesus i draw power oh for boldness and courage oh yes by the resurrection body of christ oh today i drop power i drop boldness and courage oh from the resurrected jesus oh that even today nothing of evil shall be able to stand before me in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, yes, in the name of Jesus, I draw that strength, I draw that power. We come a shantarika. Oh, from the resurrected uh, Christ. Oh, that today evil will flee away from me, danger will flee away from me. Oh, troublous tongue will flee away from me. Oh, yes, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Marie Shenteri came a hasinta. I say by the blood of Jesus, as the children of God, make yourself invisible. 
invisible, unconquerable, undestroyable by any evil that may be happening because you are going now. There are many evil. You must not go out and will not come back in. It does not glorify God. Rikama Shanta Rika Yeke Harihama Rasa Rikama Shanti through the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, I Lord, today let your power, the power of the blood, blood of Jesus Christ make me unconquerable, undestroyable. Oh, yes, by any evils of the day in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, yes, in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, we thank you. Well, let you let you let us tell God in Jesus' name we pray. Oh, Lord, make me an instrument in your hand as I go out today. Oh, to be useful. Oh, yes, in the name of Jesus, make me an instrument in your hand to be useful. Oh, to be useful for the kingdom to locate to locate goodness to locate mercy in the mighty name of jesus holy spirit we thank you in jesus name we pray amen i want you to quickly look at psalm 23 psalm 23 3 he restores my soul he leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake the leading of the lord is the most important thing we need now in our season because no one can locate pasture except christ lead you into the pasture for he is the shepherd that leads the sheep into the pasture when others are not getting it when others are not having it when others are not saying it he will release you into the pasture and you have the fullness at your side he will restore your soul he will lead you even in the, in, in, in into into a good place even in the presence of your enemies he will put you in enviable position your to your work will not become toiling you will not toil i want you to say because he that does not see the pasture will begin to toil he will toil day and night he will not see that is what happened to to Peter when he went into the sea to take to, to, to get fish. Oh, to go fishing. He said, Oh Lord, Jesus came. He said, Well, he said, Lord, I have told all night. I did not see anything. Not until Christ order. Not until Christ told him, because he knows where the pasture is. He knows where the abundance is. He said, Plunge over there. We come a shantarika. Yeki. Hari Hamaraka sent it. He said, God, Holy Spirit, as you are, according to your own word today, Holy Spirit, lead me into the green pasture. You need the leading of the green into the green pasture. Lead me into the green pasture that I will enter into harvest. Oh, that I will possess, oh Lord, Father, what is for my own portion. Oh, even today, that I will not labor in vain. That my labor will not become toiling. Rikama shanta rika yeke. Harihama raka senta. Rikama yeke. Lead me into the green pasture. Oh Lord, as the shepherd Christ Jesus, lead me into the green pasture. Oh, and nourish my soul. Oh Lord, Father. Oh, let me possess every good thing for me even today in the name of Jesus that oh that whatever I lay my hands to do hey it shall be well it shall prosper in the name of Jesus father we thank you in Jesus name we pray and he said leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake if you are not in the path of righteousness if you set out you cannot you cannot get anything you are in the devil's in the devil's legal ground you can't get anything at all you the devil will just frustrate you every of your labor because you are in the place where you want, where he can he can molest you, where he can make you to toil and not to harvest, where he can tell you <laughs> it is gone, you can't get it. Oh, but when you walk in the path of righteousness, oh Lord, let my let Lord lead me to the path of righteousness. Oh yes, that by righteousness I shall be exalted in my labor, that I will not labor in vain. Oh Lord, lead me oh into the path of righteousness, that by righteousness our oh, Father Lord. Oh, I shall, I shall not labor in vain. I shall be exalted. That my labor shall be a blessing. Oh, ye came a shantarika. Hari kama hesente. Let's see the verse 4 of that, of that verse. Kama shantarika. Yeke. Yama hasenta. Ye say, yea, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil for thou art with me. And the, the rod and the staff. Oh, Lord, guide me today. The rod and the staff of Christ is to guide you. That you will not walk into evil. Oh, by your rod and your staff. Oh Lord, comfort me today. Lead me into the good path. Oh yes, in the name of Jesus, lead me not into temptation. Lead me not into, into the pit of hell. We are in I may fall as a victim. We are in I may be destroyed suddenly. Oh Lord, let your presence overshadow me. In the mighty name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I want you to tell Christ, because as the Lord is coming, we need to know that we have to, apart from bread, we need to know that he is our sustenance in every area. There are sicknesses all around. 
if Christ will not heal you, I want you to say, Lord, I will, every sickness that is hanging in the air, oh Lord, as I set out today, ah, let them not be connect with my life. Let them not connect with my system. Let them not connect with my blood. Let them not connect with any area of my life. Oh Lord, Christ Jesus, overshadow me. Even though it's even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, the valley of the shadow of death now is not, it's not diverse sicknesses. No, it's like diverse evil. The, even the, 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 the many things are just happening. I want you to say, Lord, oh Lord, as I will set out today, Holy Spirit, Oh Lord, let me walk into the path that is right, oh Lord. Oh yes, in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit overshadow me. Let no sickness look. Okay? Every, every every arrow of sickness that has been set into the into the air. We don't see the arrow. Those sickness are arrow. Those sickness are arrow. Every arrow of sickness that is released into today. Let it not locate me. Let it not come with, in contact with my spirit. Let it not come in contact with my soul. Let it not come in contact with my blood. Oh, with any part of my body or my system. Let them not be connected unto me. Let evil arrow fly by and pass me over. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Above all, I want you to be on fire for Christ. The end time has come. You didn't serve Christ because of bread alone. You serve Christ that at the end of this journey, you and me shall be counted worthy. You should not be among those who serve Christ because of bread. When the Lord gave them bread, after giving the salmon on the mountain, and he gave bread to them, they started seeking him because of bread. And the Lord said, do you not seek me because of bread? God want those who will seek him, not because of bread. Some people will only pray because they are seeking a contract. They will only pray because they are sick. That is bread also. They will only pray because they need one thing or the other. Connect to God in power. That even as he will continue to give you victory because your victory is sure when you are connecting unto Christ. You become the branches that is fruitful. You will be fruitful. You are planted into the rivers of waters and you bring forth your fruit at its at season. So not don't serve God alone for bread. Serve him because you love him. Serve him for who he is. And then you see greater things. By love, he will open greater door unto you. Tell Jesus. Holy Spirit, let your love spread above my heart. Let me be connected unto you in power, oh Lord. Let your love spread above my heart. The love of God spread above my heart. Oh Lord, let me serve you for who you are. And by the reason of it, let me see your faithfulness in every area of my life. Prayer in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus, oh Lord, grace to serve you for who you are. Oh Lord, Father, that I will be, Father, fruitful in all that I do. Oh Lord, Father, Lord, give it unto me. Give me that grace, oh Lord. Let your love spread above my heart. In the name of Jesus, let me serve you for who you are. In the name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. As we are taking all those, all those blessings, let us always be aware that the rapture is coming. Christ is coming back very soon. Don't just be carried away. Your own case and my own case is to move from victory to victory. You must be overcome. You must overcome it. It is move from. It is to move from glory to glory. The Lord will give you ble a pleasant and pleasant pasture. You will have enough. The abundance when others are lacking. That is the grace of God for me and you. So seek God, and the Lord at this moment will fill you with the power of His presence that will terrorize your enemy and those who have been depriving you of every good things in your life. May the Lord bless you. In Jesus' name, bow down your heads and let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, we thank you for this fellowship, for this communion before you, for the devotion today. Oh Lord, as your children will set out, oh Lord, let your presence go with them. Let them be the carrier of your presence. Let evil flee from them. Let danger flow feel from them. Oh Lord, as they will go, Father, I soak them into the blood of Jesus Christ and encompass them with the fire of the Holy Ghost that they shall terrorize their enemies and those who may deprive them of their daily bread, that they will terrorize them, that they will have the grace to, to, take, to take control oh, over every situation, that it will come to favor them. In the mighty name of Jesus,
Jesus. Holy Spirit, by your home supply, we are in your supply. Oh, your home people, Father, begin to supply them. Let them not toil in vain. Let them not labor in vain. Let them not lack every good, any good thing in the name of Jesus. Even as they serve you, oh Lord, oh Lord, Father, oh Lord, give them more, the grace to know who you are. Not that they will take bread alone and depart from you, but that they will take the, that which will nourish the body, that they will be also begin to take that which will nourish the spirit, that will make them to be the, the complete overcomer, that they will be able, even at the end, that we all, all of us, shall be able to inherit, inherit an, our eternal inheritance. The Lord bless us in the mighty name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, we thank you. The presence of the Lord is upon you. Go and conquer. Go and prosper. Go and begin to do that which you cannot do before in the name of Jesus. For the anointing has been released and the power has been released unto you to do that which you cannot do before in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, many will see you and favor you. Oh, yes, in the name of Jesus. You have a dancing shoe concerning your labor in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, we thank you. Lord Jesus, we magnify your name. Father, be thou exalted. Be thou glorified in the name of Jesus. As, I, as we are praying now, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I want us to connect ourselves to Christ. He is the vine. If he is the vine, for us to be to, to flourish and to prosper, we need to connect to him as branches that will bring forth fruit. Let us bow our heads and confess Christ as our Lord, that our labor will not be toiling, that they will stay clear of our home path and we will locate pasture where others are not locating. Let's commit ourselves into the hand of God. Let's confess Christ into our life. If you have not received Christ, Please pray with me, and if you have received Christ today, reconnect yourself unto him, that you continue to prosper. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, O oh Lord Jesus, we come unto you today. We ask, Father, for a grace, Father, O oh Lord, to come nearer to you, to know you more and more, the grace to flee from sin, the grace, O oh Lord, that you, Lord, will continue to, to be our God. We ask of you today that you will take preeminence in our life, that you will reign in our life as our Lord and Savior, that you will, Father, Lord, oh, be unto us strength in every area of our life, in the mighty name of Jesus, oh, Lord, that you will give us the grace to always flee from sin and to walk in your way into fulfillment in our life, and at the end of our journey here on earth, that we shall reign with you, and we shall not miss your heavenly kingdom, in the mighty name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, we thank you, Lord Jesus, we magnify your name, in Jesus' name, we pray. Jesus love you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Jesus love you. He's the only source we are in. We can get things. Always connect to him. Don't ever you step out without connecting to your God, without having the power. The evil ones won't allow us to possess. But if you get the power of the Lord, they will move away from your own location. And you will fish and you will get the abundance. In Jesus' name. Let's share the grace together. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. May the peace of the Lord be with you. In Jesus' name. Amen.